Hey guys, welcome back or welcome if you are new. No. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to the channel or welcome. What the fuck? <clears throat> okay, hold on. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Destiny and we are finally, finally, finally back in the Crybaby Whims Legacy Stories Challenge. Um, I'm sorry I've been gone so long. If you watched um, the video that's going out before this video, um, Harlow's Makeover, uh, you would already know where I was at, but I'll just let you guys know in case you didn't watch it because I don't watch create a sim videos, so maybe you guys don't either. So, huh, goodness, uh, I went to surprise my great great not my great oh my god okay i can never talk okay it's been too long Woo. i went to surprise my grandparents so that they could see their first great grandson and i successfully made my grandma cry it was amazing loved it but yeah i stayed there for a few weeks so that is where i have been at so i'm super excited to get back i finally fixed everything in my game as far as I know. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Oh, a help center, okay. Um, I finally fixed everything in my game since all of the updates and all that craziness. And we are finally ready to play again. And if you remember in the last episode, Harlow finally came clean that she did cheat on Damien. And that is how this little cutie came to be in the world. And so, yeah, last episode was a bit of a wreck. So we are here today and we are probably going to get going on a lot of things, hopefully, because we're freaking waiting on this girl to give birth. She gives birth and what? I want to have the babies already. Okay, guys, this is taking way too long. It's just one second. Oh my God, holy cannoli, we're in labor. Oh my goodness, guys, it is time. Holy bejesus. <laughs> Don't you love how that happened? But anyways, real quick, isn't my girl gorgeous? I feel like her makeover was just perfecto. Scrum deliumptious, love it. Let me know what you guys think. I'm really digging her with black hair as well. So yeah, let me know what y'all think. But we're gonna go ahead and have these babies. So we're going to go to the hospital. Of course, her... <clears throat> husband should come right we found out in the last episode that he is the father of this child so he has no reason to not come oh my goodness and another cute outfit girl you are so freaking beautiful all right we are going to okay we have to wait for the vampire to get at the table love that go ahead and go inside together hey corinne she doesn't really like us anymore but it's fine, don't worry about it. Um, we need somebody to get to the desk. Where's the little vampire dude? Not sure, I guess until then we will go ahead and um, just reassure him and be like, hey, like this, this, the, this is your kid, okay? Just in case she was wondering, this one for sure is yours. So like, it's okay. D don't, don't, oh, he didn't take that well. Awkward. He didn't take that well? I don't know. I, they got a negative thingy. I don't think he took that well. Sir, can you sit down so we can check in? Mister, we're trying to have our baby. Go sit down. I can't check in until you sit down. Is this for real? Oh, please, thank heavens. Oh, thank heavens. A well, I was about to say a sensible person, but I guess not. Does no one want to sit down so we can have our children? Please. Let me just real quick see how Damien took that. Oh, he's hurt. And he's in pre-parental panic. What are you about to do? Okay, um, friendly introduction. Uh, he's, oh, he's insulting her again. No, not right now. She's about to have a baby. Don't insult her right now. Oh, thank heavens. A sensible person. Hey, can we, can we check in please? We're having a baby. <laughs> Oh my god, their relationship is going down, down, down because he keeps insulting her. Oh my god, he's doing it again. Oh, he's yelling at her. Oh my god, she's, imagine you're in labor and it's no fun, let me tell you. And he's just like insulting the crap out of her and yelling at her. Okay, can we just, let's just go have the child, um, Harlow. Let's, let's go, cutie. Goodness. Oh, we're going behind the counter to check in. Okay, yeah, mm-hmm. Isn't she cute? I think I did pretty good on her makeover. Okay, hello? 
We were here first, Katrina. Yeah, yeah. Can we, did we check in? Can we go have our baby? Let's go. Perfect, we're off. We are off to have a baby. Here it goes, guys. And uh, we decided to be blonde for this. Lovely, lovely. Okay. Oh, a different, a different doctor. Corinne is really mad at us. She like didn't even want to be here. Okay. Mm, oh, well. Hey, Damien, I know you're mad at us, but could you please just jog in here real quick, please? Thank you. You should at least be here for your kids, if anything. <laughs> Okay, it's a boy, so I'm going to go with Jasper, which is what was one of the names that I was in between whenever we were naming Theo. And it's a baby girl. I'm so excited. Okay, I did not cheat the twins, okay? I know I said I wanted twins, and I'm not gonna lie to you, I was gonna cheat it and make it twins if it wasn't twins, but it just so happened that it was twins, and so, Blessed be, we are done with Damien's kids. So the baby girl is gonna be called Sutton Thatcher. So we have Jasper and Sutton. So stinking cute, look. Oh my goodness. Let's come over here and bounce um, Jasper because Sutton has disappeared. <laughs> oh, how exciting. I'm so excited. Is she at least happy to have the baby? Damien, how are you feeling about having the baby? He doesn't have a mood lit yet. Okay, whatever. Oh, look at Jasper. Oh, he is not happy. <laughs> He's so cute. And then also, if you remember in the last episode, she has the fear now of being cheated on, which I am I believe is because she herself is a cheater. So she's probably like, oh my God, like what if he cheats on me? Like imagine, sweetheart, you're not wearing that home, please. Um, so yeah, now she has the fear of being cheated on, so she's gonna be extra finicky around Damien, even though we all know that it's her that's the cheater. This is my favorite freaking outfit, I'm sorry. She's so cute! Okay, let's go home, my love. <laughs> and let's go see these little, t these little kiddos. I'm so excited. All right, Damien, I bet you're on the computer, aren't you? Of course you are, okay. He always is straight upstairs on the darn computer. But let's go see our little babies. Who is this? Um, who is this? This is Jasper, where did it decide to put her? Okay, let me go ahead and grab a second crib since we have our little twin babies. All right, there we go. Our little babies have been placed. Damien, why don't you go ahead and come up here and cuddle little Sutton baby and Mama can come and, okay. Oh, okay, I'll change it, don't worry. Um, but we're gonna come up here, oh my goodness. We are gonna come up here and feed Jasper Dad, don't make Sutton mad. You can go ahead and you need to bottle feed the baby, please. <laughs> All right, hurry, hurry, babies to feed, babies to feed. Perfecto. Okay. So cute, love it. I'm so excited to finally be done having babies. Okay, and then we will change the dirty diaper. Dad, dad, does um, Sutton have a dirty diaper? Why doesn't this one have a, a bear? <laughs> Wait a minute. Why does this one have a bear, but this one doesn't have a bear? Okay, I don't know. Uh, go ahead and change her dirty diaper too. They they sent them home from the hospital just needing everything, okay? Love that for us. And then you can also go ahead and give her a cuddle and make a silly face. Love that for you. Jeez, mama, how much food are you giving him? This is Jasper, right? I don't know if it's just like a boy thing, but even my son, like when I was breastfeeding him, oh my God. Like there was nothing better than being attached to the boob, okay? Let me tell you, it was just, it was a lot. It was a lot to handle, okay? It was a lot. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh my goodness. Okay, what time is it? It is three in the morning. Harlow is a bit hungry. And also in the last episode, we kind of like, you know, forgot about our kids a little bit, but I don't think they really need anything. So, hey, we're not doing too bad. Okay, actually, Theo is tired. So we can go ahead and ask Dada, hmm, stand in Dada <laughs> to put us to bed bed.
Oh, and she's going through it again for having cheated on Damien. She's paranoid because she thinks that he's cheating on her and just, she's just, she's going through it. Oh my God, Axel. <gasps> we have not been treating Axel good. Oh my goodness. Okay. So we are going to go ahead and fill and call little Axel baby to bed. We need to put Miss Blair to sleep. Oh, okay. I guess she's gonna ask her mom to go to sleepy time. What are you doing? What? Oh. What are you doing? Okay, you're just watching mama, that's fine. Damien went ahead and went straight to sleep. So after what is this? No, why, what? Is he awake? Go to sleep. Lay your head down, lay your cute little head down and go night night, okay, please, thank you. No, you're not going to get him. No, 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 Harlow. Put your daughter to sleep, please. All right, let's go, Blair. Hold on, oh my God, we're coming. Go to sleep. All right, perfect. All right, no, what? Oh my goodness. We're coming, Axel. Oh my gosh. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <gasps> I'm stressed. Go. Seriously? Go feed the darn dog. Right now, fill and call Mr. Axel to eat. Thank you. Heavens. Okay, we have to. <gasps> you. We have to use the restroom and then we are going to go off to cry it out <laughs> right next to our husband and then we will go to sleep. <laughs> oh my gosh, is Sutton crying? No, nope. she's been a little angel baby. All is good in the world, don't worry guys. Oh, we're getting negative emotions while we cry next to him. Like, heck, this guy, we cheated on him, he sucks. <laughs> oh no, Jasper's awake now too. Okay, I think they're just, they're just babbling to each other. All is good, all is good. All is good and well. Damien, do you have work today? Thank goodness we need money. Harlow is filling. Worked up. Harlow feels a rush of anger when she thinks about how that sim always puts work first. Oh, yeah. Because she feels neglected by a workaholic. Oh, no. Look at their relationship. Oh, no. Damien, what have we done to you? Oh, it feels like it's been forever since Damien has been romantic with his partner. Yeah, that's because, like, Y'all aren't good for each other. Oh my gosh, oh my goodness. But in other words, it's night out on the town and I definitely think that Harlow, you know, she just had her kids and she wants to go out, okay? Like, she is not feeling it with D Mr. Damien because now she's con trying to convince herself that he is cheating on her because she is such a terrible person, okay? So, I think the kiddos are awake. Nope, just Blair, of course. It's always just Blair. Love that for us. Why don't we, can we like give her some food? Can I just click on her? Oh, give food. Oh. We can give her a rose to eat, guys. Oh, that was interesting. Okay, we can give her a rose to eat. Uh, why don't we try to like go give her something else? Toddler care, yeah. Give her something to eat. Damien is such a little baby. He's still sleeping. My son is crying downstairs and I do not know what's going on. I'm stressed. My husband's doubt there, okay? It's not like I didn't just leave him down there and just, you know, he's being taken care of. Anyways, I'm gonna fast forward while she's asleep. Okay, little Damien baby is awake. Hi, handsome. We will go ahead and come over here and take care of him. Oh, I'm not even clicked on him, one sec. We're gonna go ahead and come, never mind, dad, to the rescue. Does, does Damien, does Theo stink? He kinda does, but we are going to give him some food first. Okay, I keep clicking on the wrong, ah! I forgot how to play! Okay, 
We are going to go ahead and give some food to the baby. And then mom, since you wanted to have a sleep in, it is going to be your job to come upstairs and take care of the babies. We will go ahead and breastfeed Sutton first since Jasper got the teat last night. <laughs> All right, she's, no, don't you dare want it. Oh, gosh darn it, she's putting the toy away. I want the toy out. Okay, oh. Oh, look at him, cutie pie. Okay, we are going to go ahead and ask mama for a bath because she is awake and it is time for her to take her sad little butt and take care of her duties because Damien has work today and does not have time. Look at her, she's so cute does not have time for their nonsense. So we're gonna go ahead and come have him use the bathroom. Are you going to bathe your son? Harlow is just all full of emotions right now. She's all over the place. I told her to give him a bath and she went upstairs. She's losing her mind, okay? Mixed with pregnancy brain and just her overall sadness for the actions that she has done, she is just not thinking straight. Can we give him a bath, please? Ah, give the child a bath. Where'd it go? Give Theo a bubble bath, please, my love. Damien, I'm sorry, but there's no need for you guys to talk right now. What are you doing? Okay, well, this is the bath I told you to go in the first place. And can you, Harlo, sweetheart, can you take this off while you're taking care of your children? Like, I know I gave you some cute jammies, but like... <laughs> Chill out. Why don't we get in? This outfit is so freaking cute. Okay, why don't we get, we'll, we'll go for a dress today, cute butt. Gosh, she's cute. All right, Damien, he is feeling embarrassed and just overall uncomfortable. And he also has anxiety from being cheated on or fear of being cheated on. Honey, you don't need to be fearful of being cheated on. You have already been cheated on, my love. Like, it's too late. It's too late for you. <laughs> Oh, he's feel okay, he's feeling embarrassed. So I wanna see what I think he's gonna like. Mm. I no, Damien's too good of a too good of a guy. He would not, he would never, he wouldn't do that. Okay. We're not gonna have him do it. But we will have him go Axel! Okay, you know what? <laughs> we are going to go ahead and have him take the little bunkin on a jog before he goes to work. Oh, and another question for you guys. Who do you think is going to keep the dog? Obviously, we probably already know that it's going to be her. What kind of bath is this? Oh my God, this game. Anyways, we already, Harlow. <laughs> oh my God, I was a, this is a mess. Okay, we already know that Harlow's probably gonna keep the dog, just like she's gonna probably keep like a lot of things, right? Here, if you wanna be like half undressed if so freaking bad, at least be in like workout clothes or something, okay? Can you mop this? Thanks, love you. Anyways, we already know that she's gonna keep like probably most stuff in this house just because she's rotten. Spoiled rotten, okay? I tell you, she's spoiled rotten. <laughs> she's never worked a day in her life and she just, she's just a brat. But anyways, it is her dog, but I was just curious what you guys would think, so let me know. Because Damien has kind of, since Harlow has just nonstop been pregnant for like her entire lifespan at this point, he has been the primary caregiver to Axel, but Harlow has been the um, affectionate owner, the one that gives him the most attention, you know what I mean? You know what I'm trying to say? Um, yeah, so that's what I mean. We're gonna go ahead and come over here and have a no sweat run, because we gotta get that. What? All right, are you sick? What's wrong? What's, what? What's going on? Okay. What was I saying? Oh yeah, we have to get our pre-pregnancy body back because we just had the kids. So finally we're not pregnant, let's get it. And then we are going to go ahead. and check our bills information. So unfortunately, I know that I owed like a, a ton of money, but I had to update this mod so it kind of restarted and I don't even know how to like, I don't think you can cheat this, but we still owe an arm and a leg. So 
After we work out, I'm gonna have Harlow <laughs> argue with Damien about who's going to pay these bills, okay? Shoot, we're just we're just gonna argue talk about marriage yeah we're just gonna argue about everything because what else is there to like talk about you know like he's embarrassed she's sad digital tears i had to let everyone know today was just not my day okay and now she's being freaking she's getting on social media and talking about her soon divorce and everything that's going wrong in her relationship that is one thing that you do not do okay you do not flaunt your problems about anything to anyone, especially family, because they're quick to like, you talk about one argument and then they hate your partner for the rest of your life. So like, don't be stupid, okay? Anyways, where's Damien? Damien! Okay, go ahead. Go ahead and head home, my love. Oh, no, 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 no. What was that? What was that? No! No hugs. Talk about marriage. We're going to... <laughs> eh, let's see what we can do, guys. Not mischief, mean. Hmm. Complain about partner's family. <gasps> okay, so what I just said. You never tell your family about your problems, right? Okay. So I know that Harlow has confided in Brandy, but Brandy did not take Harlow's side. Brandy told her what was good and what was right, okay? So, but I'm gonna, so Damien is such a sweet guy. So I feel like he probably talked to his parents and was like, I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. Like, why would she do this to me? I love her so much. He said nothing negative about her, but Harlow is just a spiteful person. And she's going to complain about his family because why did you tell them that I cheated on you? How dare you tell them that I'm a bad person, even though she is, right? So she's gonna complain about her partner, about Damien's family, and we're gonna see how that goes for her with her sad little butt. But we're not gonna come over right now, Marina, but we are gonna go out on night on the town, so don't you worry. Okay, hold on. I don't want the dog to be a part of this. All right, go ahead and unleash him so he can go be where he pleases to be so he's not stuck here. Why do you keep doing that? She doesn't want to do it. Okay. <laughs> Talk about marriage. Please, please do what I say. Please. No, we're not going to apologize. Sh shut up. We're not doing it. And then we're complaining about his family. Or, yeah, his family. Oh, he's having none of this. Your mom sucks. She thinks I'm a bad person for cheating on you. Well, no crap, you're a bad person, but how dare her feel like that about me? You know what I mean? That's how that's how she feels. That's that's how she thinks. Okay, let's <laughs> let's family therapy mod, family social interactions. Um discuss reasons for poor relationship. Let's see what that is going to do. And then we will also <laughs> uh, damn it I keep exiting out of it okay let her do that real quick and then we are going to why are you looking at your phone all sad and stuff blame for problems in the relationship yes do it what's he doing what are you doing Damien why you look so sad honey oh I feel so bad for Damien. I hate doing this to him. It's your fault I cheated. I cheated because of you. <laughs> He's probably like, Harlow, what did I ever do to you but like pay for you, pay your bills and take care of you and our family. She's having none of this. She does not want to hear your, your, um, what am, what am I, she does not want to hear your, um, huh. You know what, guys? I don't know. She, Oh, why can I never I can I'm so bad at like arguing and like making mean things happen. Um, she's gonna go ahead and just She's feeling emotional and she's gonna tell him that she hates him because He was never there for her whenever he should have been even though he was okay. Obviously. This is all oh, no <gasps> Obviously, this is all lies guys on her part. She just feels like 
she is she's not a grown like she she needs she oh my god she has a lot of growing up to do and she just rather than take accountability for her actions she would rather blame damien for everything that she has done wrong everything that she's chosen to do out of her own ill intentions rather than take accountability for that she is blaming this poor little innocent baby boy over here for everything and she just said that she hated him and he said that he hates her too but i don't believe that D oh <laughs> And now he's criticizing her for her relationship preferences, which Damien, you go, baby. You tell her that having multiple partners is disgusting and we just can't even believe that she thought that that was acceptable. And hello, he thinks that she is a hypocrite. It seems hypocritical to Damien to be blamed by his partner for the full responsibility of their relationship whenever she's the one that cheated. <laughs> Thank you, Damien, absolutely. Oh, wow, hey. Wait, do we know her? <gasps> Bianca! Do you wanna be our friend? <laughs> hey, did you just see that argument? Don't even worry about it. You wanna be our friend? Oh, you're married. Who are you married to? Oh, let's just, oh. Let's go ahead and just see how she's doing. We're having a paranoid moment because she just, um, <laughs> she just saw us get in a fight with our husband and we just said we hated each other. So we're going to go ahead and be like, Hey, you have a beautiful ring on your finger. How do you and your husband do it? Have you ever cheated on him? Just curious. Just just curious if that's the kind of stuff that you that you do. Um, and then we're gonna boast about our family. We're gonna be like, listen, I know you just saw me and my husband going at it, but we really love our kids and <laughs> things just got a bit messed up, okay? <laughs> She's so cute though, right? Is she cute? I didn't create her. She was off of the gallery, but she is so stinking cute. Um, wow, hello. Damien. Oh. No, I'm going to let you give yourself a pep talk. Um, Mom, you can go ahead and come in here and get on to Blair again. How many times have we told this innocent, sweet little girl to stop making messes on our floor? So we're going to yell at her. It's literally yelling on sight now because she never listens. Sorry, Bianca. We have to go get on to our child real quick. I don't want to hear it. I don't care. Why can't we make toddlers clean up messes, by the way? Like, that's absolutely ridiculous. Oh my god, I forgot we had kids. Oh, bless you, Damien. I forgot we had babies up here. <laughs> Go ahead and change Jasper's dirty diaper. Sutton, do you have a dirty diaper yet, my love? Mm, no. Oh, that, was that not what the baby needed? Is the baby hungry? Go ahead and feed the baby. Uh, okay, yeah, the baby was, the baby was hungry. Okay, and then we will go ahead and give him a cuddle. Sutton, we will go ahead and bottle feed you, my love, and give you a bounce. We will go ahead and fill this again for our little baby. Excuse me, wasn't he supposed to go to work? Oh, work in two hours? He works at 2 p.m. to 11 p.m. now? Holy cannoli and oh my goodness. Look at their relationship, guys. <laughs> He's still deeply in love with her, though. Why? Why do you love this absolute train wreck? What do we think of Bianca? Oh, she gave us good advice. And oh, hey, hey, she's married to Marcus Flex. Okay. I know you're not about to. Theo, come on. Y'all are supposed to be, like... Sweet, you can enroll in preschool, imagine. Let's go just wander around. Do not make a mess, please. Your mother is already going through it, okay? <sighs> can we confide our problems in Mr. Axel and give him a comforting hug, please? Please, give us some, give us some, um, love. We need it. What is this? What did, where, where did that go? What, what is that? Is it a phone? I don't know. Okay. Oh, Axel, what are we gonna do, my love? We really made a mess of this. This beautiful house, 
these beautiful kids, your beautiful self, and I just really went and made a mess of everything, and now I don't know what I'm gonna do. But I just, I don't think I can stay in this relationship anymore, and we're gonna have to go to a different house. <laughs> and you're gonna miss out on all of this beautiful stuff, and I'm really sorry, but I just, I really ruined things, okay? So I feel like, I feel like Harlow's inner monologue, she's very honest with herself and she um, she acknowledges that she was the problem in all of the mess that has occurred. But when it comes to her talking to Damien, she is absolutely not going to admit that she was the problem. So, I mean, she knows that she's the problem, but she's just not gonna let him know that she knows that she's the problem. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> This is where Harlow needs to do some growing up, and she needs to be the bigger person and, and um, just grow up, okay? That's all. Oh, you got a stinky diaper. Okay, Damien will get it for you. It's okay. <laughs> And Damien is off to work. All right, we're going to go ahead and work hard, please. Let me make sure the kiddos are good. They are. Baby girl, let's go ahead and you can play the xylophone and you, my love, can play rock a stack stack. I think that's what that said. <laughs> and we will go ahead and sell that for $313. Hey, hey. Oh my god, she has the she has an awful reputation. Okay, so her cheating on Damien is actually catching up to her. All right. Um, so there's that. Love that. It is also almost three o'clock, so we are gonna go ahead and travel with Marina to do a night out on the town. We're gonna send all 50 bajillion of the kids to daycare because mama apparently needs a break. All right, we're going to go to Samai Shuno and try to find a nice club. All right. Hello, hello, you cutie pies. It's been forever. And Marina has also had her child already. I think she had her child a few episodes ago. Discuss current drug market. Wait a minute. Is she a drug dealer? Oh, hey, hey. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and ask about, you know, this is Harlow, okay? She's not going to go crazy, but let's just ask about cannabis and see what she says. I did not know she was a drug... I didn't make her a drug dealer in this LP, I don't think. Did I? She wasn't a drug dealer in... I don't know. I have heard that cannabis is pretty cheap in Strangerville and expensive in Glimmerbrook. Okay, how about in Samai Shuno? How about that? Where'd it go? What? Why'd it disappear? Okay, well it disappeared. So let's just go ahead and ask about her day. And then we will go ahead and go inside and let's order drinks for everybody. Let's get it going. We will order for the group. Oh yeah, zero dollars. So let's go for the most expensive. <laughs> uh, most expensive, Plasma Jane. Let's go ahead and go for it. This, I just realized, Harlow. Come on, queen. What is going on? Her head is in 50 million places other than in the present moment. But oh my goodness, does she not look so cute in this? I just had to give her this outfit. So cute, love it. Okay, let's go ladies, let's get some drinks. Let's get it going. <laughs> Why are y'all setting so far away? Okay, thank you, Bianca, thank you. I appreciate you. Let's go ahead and just talk to the ladies, see how they are doing get to know each other express our relief over our birth gone well as well with um marina because she also just had her baby so we're gonna see how her birth went and let her know that we did good hello oh wait hello wow listen i know you're a vampire amber ambrose but hey you're no, no, stop it, stop it. But hey, I still want to say hello because you're cute. 
Is anyone else here? Who's this? Akira. Hmm. Guys, he's cute. Wait a minute. My sad little baby girl is going to go ahead and talk to him a little bit. She is sad. She needs a male's perspective. This is what she's telling. Oh. Hey. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. So we're going to see how she responds to that. Okay. She did not accept it. That's good. Okay. Maybe... We are making progress, but he is very flirty being next to her, so that is curious. Let's go ahead and ask, um, what was his name again? Ambrose, his, for some advice. And then we are going to go ahead and order more drinks for the group. Apparently what I ordered them was disgusting. So we're gonna go ahead and get a bridge port. Tell him that he looks nice in his suit and tie. Share the night out on the town. Yes, love that. Where's Marina? She's coming, okay. As if, oh no, this is Marcus Flex. I thought it was Nick. But he's quite handsome. He's, he's, oh, that's her husband. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> I swear to goodness, Harlow, do not do what I was just thinking of doing. Oh, look at you, cute guys. Your husband came to see you. That's adorable. I love that. Love that, love that, love that. Ooh, let's complain about our sibling. Oh, oh. No, we'll just brighten his day. That's okay. We'll discuss interest with Marina. Did he just try to flirt with her again? What is going on with this vampire, guys? Oh my goodness gracious, okay. Let's get drunk, guys. Where did the vampire go? Wait. I don't know, but all right. Bianca, your husband just came to check on you and then left? That is so freaking cute. How sweet is he? Do you not like Bianca or something, Harlow? Why did you move like, away from her? That's pretty mean. What's wrong with her? Why is she uncomfortable? What's wrong, sweetheart? It's, hmm. Why is she sad? Can we take a picture with all with all of us? Please. Please, can we? That would be so freaking cute. Where's the... Here it goes. Take a photo. What, oh, you can only take it with one at a time? That's stupid. Okay. Let's go ahead and take a picture with everybody, please. What's his name? Grampy? Okay. How cute are they? They're so freaking adorable. They're so cute. I'm obsessed. No, I don't like that one. Mm, can barely see you guys in that one. We've already seen that one. Let's see this one. Oh my god, queens! They're so cute. Let's see this one. Oh. Oh, this is the flirty ones. Wait, hold on. <laughs> this is the goofy ones. Okay, I wanna go back to that one. Yes, 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 yes. How freaking cute are they? I love it. Okay, Bianca, can we take a picture with you now, my love? <laughs> oh no, she's gonna wet herself. Oh my God. Oh, I'm such an asshole. Oops. Oh well, she'll be fine. You deserve it, Harlow. I love you, but you deserve it. <laughs> Why are y'all so sad? Can we like, hello, can we just? Please. Oh, yes, that's the one. So cute. No, I can't see her face. Okay, um, let's try this one. They're so freaking adorable. Oh my goodness, I'm obsessed. Obsessed with them. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh no. As if. Okay, um, let's come wash our hands and brush our teeth a few times. No one saw that. It's okay. Go away before anyone cute shows up. 
Okay, is she even drunk at all? I'm so <laughs> I don't know. I think it's because I had her drinking, but I do not know why she freaking peed so so quickly. Like why her bladder filled. And we are utterly wasted, guys. Smooth sipping. So I don't know why it let us ask uh, Marina anything about the drug market because I don't think that she's a drug. Because I don't think that she's a drug dealer. Hey, Nick. Okay. Uh, because I don't think she's a drug dealer. But I'm, you know, all the same. If it happens, it happens. So totally fine. But I'm curious. Do you guys remember... Um, in the last episode, Harlo was starting her nonsense again. And she had a whim about Nick. So, she's going to see him whenever she walks out of the restroom, and I think that she, just kidding, he's just gonna walk up in the restroom on her. Love that. She probably saw him in the window like, oh my god, really? But she's wasted, so like also she's like, oh my god, really? She's feeling great. She's drunk. <laughs> So she's gonna go ahead and apologize to him and just be like, look, listen, a couple days ago, I was thinking about you and I was just wondering, you know, like I wanted to cloud gaze with you. Get out of the bathroom and stop crying. What are you doing? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I was thinking about you the other day. Never a good way to start a conversation with your ex, by the way. <laughs> you shouldn't start a conversation with them, period. But anyways, and I was thinking about you the other day when the clouds were passing by and I was like, wow, the clouds are so beautiful. And I was just thinking about you and I wondered how you were doing. So we're gonna ask him how his day is oh he accepted the apology good what does she think of um nick by the way still he still thinks he's extremely attractive what did we think of ambrose nothing we thought nothing of him okay great love that <laughs> No! <laughs> Before he can get that out, I'm going to queue up one thing for her, okay? Just one thing. I can feel you guys looking at me through the screen. Leave me alone. I just have a thing that I want to go down the storyline, so... Stop insulting us, Nick! Can we have a hug? We love you! Oh. Well... That storyline's not gonna happen. Okay, bye, Nick. Oh, Ambrose is back. <laughs> Ambrose, hey! When it doesn't work with one, it can work with another. She's drunk, guys. I want you to keep in mind. I mean, that's no excuse. We already know she's a cheater, so she really has no excuses at all. Drunk or so, whoa, hello. Hey! <laughs> He's already flirty, too. Oh my god, this is terrible. Harlow just wants somebody to comfort her because she knows dang well she can't go home and get comfort from Damien because Damien hates her stinking guts as they made clear earlier. So now she, I just feel like she's just, she's just, she's like, she doesn't care anymore. She gave up. She doesn't care. She just, hey, screw it. He hates me. I hate him. Why does it even, why does anything even matter anymore? Who's Judah? I think McKenna Hager is pretty cute. Absolutely! This is our stalker gym buddy. Please go away. How cute! We're flirting with a vampire, guys! Ooh! <laughs> Ooh! Look at us! Okay, Nick, you can go away, alright? We tried to flirt with you, but you just didn't accept it, so just bye! What the heck is he? <laughs> Why? Why is he insulting us? Leave us alone, Nick. Why are you jealous? Why are you mad? We tried to flirt with you first. Okay, we're drunk. Go away. Oh, we're no longer best friends. Can you please, Nick, please go away. Please. Nick. I can't, even, I can't even click on you. Okay, whatever. I can't click on anyone. Okay, I got it. <sighs> okay. Discuss the relationship status, even though we just met him. We're so sad. Look at us. We're both so sad, but she's just like, heck it. Heck everything. Heck it all. 
I say we should spend more time together. Cute! Hear about Ambrose's video game prowess. Oh, she liked that. She's used to hearing that from Damien. <laughs> he always used to try to impress her um, like that. Okay, and she can impress him with her high romance skill now. Damien, I mean, Nick, can you please go away? Oh my god, they have a relationship bar already. Every time we flirt with Ambrose, he gets a negative impression. Watch. Watch this. Yeah, their friendship absolutely went away because she's flirting with him. What is he asking us? He's telling us a funny story. Okay. Oh, and Damien's at work. We're such an asshole. Okay, watch her flirt with him. And then their relationship goes down. Oh, it didn't go down now. Oh my god! Marina! Is she pregnant and I made her drink? <gasps> Please don't be pregnant. Please don't be pregnant. Please don't be pregnant. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, she's not pregnant. She's just drunk. It's fine. Nick is really just trying to be up in this conversation. Nick, go away, please. Does she feel anything towards him? She's amused by his great story. Oh, and she's utterly enamored. Don't do that. Don't do that. I clicked on the wrong thing. Do not do that. She is... Mm. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Her drunken self at the bar. She thinks that she is deeply in love with him. Oh. My goodness, imagine, imagine she goes out for a night on the town, gets completely wasted, tries to flirt with her ex, and he turns her down. So she just finds the next available person that he tried to flirt with her first. So she's like, oh, I absolutely know that he's going to be down to flirt. And then now she just is like, oh my God, I think I love him. What kind of messiness is this? Oh my goodness, she's a wreck. She's a wreck, but I love her. I love her. Oh my God. Now she's leaping into his arms. Cute. Okay. Uh, well, you know, um, what time does Damon get off? Well, I like, I don't even know. <sighs> this has really come full circle, hasn't it? All right. Um, Oh, she's no longer in a sad mood, is she? No, she is. Okay. I think that tonight, if it has if it has done anything, it has definitely helped her realize that she, I mean, she already knew it, but now she's coming to terms with the fact that her marriage is dead. Dead, dead, dead. So she's just having a grand old time. Love that for us, Harlow. Okay, great. She's having a grand old time over here with this little vampire buddy. And you know, heck it, I'm, I'm having a grand old time too. <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> Let's go ahead and be like, listen, we, I love you so much. You're perfect. You just seem great. Seems like I've known you for years. We're gonna go ahead and, oh. Uh-oh, something's not going good. Something's not going good. Ladies, ladies, let me go ahead and order everyone food. I completely forgot you guys were here. Hello, who are you? You're so cute. Grace, you're adorable. Okay. Let's go ahead and order. Oh, everything's free, I forgot. A meat and cheese platter because we are starving. Vampire disappeared on us. No biggie, no biggie. And we will just talk to Bianca a little bit more. We'll go ahead and complain about our problems. We are drunk, drunk, drunk now. Oh my goodness, he's singing. So cute. Wow, he's really just sticking around, you know? Like, I think he's into us. <laughs> Obviously, he's into her. <laughs> Ladies, also, why not? Let's go ahead and come up here and try this together. And just, I don't think alcohol and cannabis mix as well together, but screw it. This is a Sims. We're going to go for it. And I think Marina left. I'm not going to lie. Did Bianca leave? No, there's Bianca. Okay. Okay. I know this is trash. <laughs> yeah, it's trash. Okay, Bianca, try it, my love. It's almost Blair's birthday. She's gonna be a child. Love it. 
Okay. Bianca, are you gonna are you gonna try it, Queen? You have to try it. Whoa! Oh my goodness, she's in a flirty mood, guys. This is hilarious. Okay, um, I think Bianca's trying to leave. It is almost seven o'clock. Damien, what time do you get home again? I keep forgetting. Oh my god, he doesn't get home until eleven. Oh my gosh, why is she mad? Whoa, what's going on? Ask what happened. Yeah, what what's the matter? How are you? Oh my god. Why is Harlow like this? <laughs> nasty, nasty. Okay. Our guy is staying around, I guess. We're gonna come back down here and talk about our marriage. Wait, is he married? Oh no. Is a vampire gonna come and kill us? No, I don't think he's married. Okay, we're gonna come down here and, and let's not talk about the marriage. Um, we don't wanna know. What we don't know is better, is all the better. Oh, okay. We need to get out of this sadness. Come on, girl. Compliment his personality. Um, let's go ahead and... Hmm. Discuss his woohoo preferences. Let's just, let's come down here and just heck it all, all right? Why can't I do anything? Come on, stop it. All right, come get him, girl. Come get him, girl. Oh, she's still trying to get high. Okay, come on, girl, let's go. Let's get him. <laughs> oh my God, look how red her eyes are. Oh my God, this is crazy. I love it. <laughs> this is great. Oh. You wanna become best friends? Of course. Sure, the more the better. Oh my God, she's a wreck. I can't believe this. I cannot believe this. Okay, I'm clicking on the wrong person. I'm trying to talk to him. Okay, let's post about our family as well. Might as well like not lie about having a family cause you know, that'd be awkward. Stop disappearing, we're trying to talk to you. You're really making this hard, dude. Thank you, like, Stop being crazy. <laughs> Thanks. I can only do one thing. Like, I don't want to compliment your personality 5,000 times. Like, this is not fun. All right, my girl's getting paranoid. We're going to go ahead and grab a serving of this real quick and then we're gonna go ahead and head home uh we're not gonna go too far i don't think i mean obviously she's not in the mood and then also like she doesn't want any more kids and neither do i please but i feel like she's just she's absolutely given up on this relationship she knows that there's no sense of fixing it so she just decided to just heck it like if i want to flirt i'm gonna flirt don't care wait a minute Wow, he's cute, but we need to go home. Okay. <laughs> but all right, I am gonna go ahead and end this episode off right here. Uh, it was a little bit all over the place, kind of fast forwarded because I just, I wanted to get things going a little bit more today. Um, so the next episode is going to be a heavy episode, so I hope you guys are prepared for it. I'm sure you know where I'm going with this, um, at this point, but I really hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Let me know what you think of Harlow's makeover, the new babies, their names, um, and let me know what you think of Harlow in general at this point, like her wreck of a personality self. She's like, she's literally hitting rock bottom. We thought... A few episodes ago was the rock bottom, but it's absolutely right now is rock bottom. So let me know what you guys think. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing if you are not already. And I am so excited to see you in the next episode and get this challenge going. Bye.